What up boys and welcome back to another video. So today is it's day number seven. Yeah, it's been a week in the 20 days of gold making series. So we're just going to jump right onto it. So today's question is as following. If you were starting over again on a new server, how would you start building up capital? Like how would you first start out farming gold? And what goal would you set for yourself? I mean, I've already done this, right? I'm not sure if you guys followed that series or if you watched me back then. But uh, a lot of you guys wanted me to uh, try out and start like totally fresh. Because a lot of you guys meant that I make a lot of gold because I got like every single class, a lot of different tunes, do different stuff with every single day. And uh, so I took on the challenge and I leveled myself up a horror druid. And uh, I wanted to see how fast I could reach gold cap. Gold cap was 1 million gold back then. So yeah, I would basically, like I want to answer this question with the challenge and how I did it, basically. Uh, my goal was to get gold cap in one month. I did. I believe I got it in like 26 days or something. And some tips for you guys that are starting out. I'm actually on my bank too now because I want to show you guys something. Uh, you can see all these auctions, they're from today. I posted these before I went to work and they're all cloaks, like every single auction right here is just cloaks and tsm pro tip before i forget you guys definitely need tsm i'm saying this every single video now so it's, uh, you guys should probably have it right if you don't you're doing something wrong but uh yeah a tsm will tell you that these cloaks go for like five gold 12 gold etc but i mean they sell trust me like that's the evidence of like how well they sell and regardless of what you do if you go and kill fucking boars and they drop a cloak you can sell that shit for like 300 to a thousand gold no joke people want them for transmog people need them to get the uh the fashionista achievement uh, people buy shit ton of cloaks it's similar to shirts but cloaks are just easier to get well to farm uh they're really easy so whatever regardless of what farm i do regardless of what level the cloak is I always keep it and I always sell it and there's not really that many cloaks in the auction now so you can't really compare prices with other people so you just gotta you just gotta test it out and see how much gold you can get out of the shirts basically but uh, yeah and when I first started out uh, the leveling part itself has uh, is really it's not really that important for me I know some people they really they do a lot of research into the different items they they go and they like try to level gold farm efficiently where they go and do the quest where they know you can get good stuff i didn't really care about that i just leveled to 100 in a few hours and uh, i just started gold farming right away i believe the best way to to start getting into the game is actually getting into the game like getting to max level because let's face it that's where you're going to make the most gold so get to max level so you can start pumping out those professions and do those raids and so on like cataclysm raids always a no-brainer go and do cataclysm raids even now if the nerf get some raw gold get started buy yourself a mammoth mount pro tip it's it's going to be so much easier when you're like opening out in world or like doing instance farming you can just mount up on that bad boy and vendor all the shit so that's probably the first item you should invest into uh, i would probably go for hex weave bags and then go for the mammoth it, it's the best investment you'll ever make trust me but other than that is it's I don't really have that many tips. Uh, I've already done it. If you guys haven't seen me go from 1 to 100 and getting gold cap, you can find the videos right up here, like the recap video. Uh, but yeah, so just get TSM. When you level, sell sell everything. Like sell the cloth, sell all the cloaks and all the transmog items, even if they're like 200 gold items. I mean, you got you got no auctions though, right? You're new to the game. So you your auction house is empty. So just start filling up that auction house, even though the items are just like 200, 250 gold according to TSM. I mean, if you have enough of them in the auction house, they will sell eventually. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, kind of sucked that I already did this, uh, kind of answered this question by doing the challenge like a couple of months back. But uh, it is what it is. I'm looking forward to tomorrow's question. And if you're also looking forward to it, you can always feel free to press subscribe right down here. And I will be back tomorrow with another video. So have a good day, boys. See you then. Bye bye.